just listen to music. I love music. Why do I gotta... Oh, I get it. If something bad were to happen, I wouldn't hear them. What if everyone walked around with headphones in? No one would hear anything, and that's kind of dangerous in a school. And if I have earbuds in both ears, they can't tell if I can hear them or not. I can hear ya. Alright, thanks Anthony. And the hat. And the other hat. And the other hat. Why? This is me. This is who I am. And I'm cold. This is... Oh, hang on. They aren't making the judgment if on hats and hoodies are right or wrong. Brisson wears hoodies all the time. Anderson wears hats. Maybe these rules exist because someday there might be something that happens. And all students might need to hear an announcement or be identified to make sure they are okay. I mean, it's a safety measure like a seatbelt. You got it. <laughs> I'm like, the mass of Jupiter is way more than Earth. Okay. They're fascinated by this. I'm just like, who is she? Like, she's like weird. I don't know. Am I right? Super fascinated. Science, though. What? So weird. All these rules. I'm hungry. Why do I have to eat where they say? Oh, wait. They aren't just making these rules up to make us mad. The school needs to be clean for everyone, and the easiest way to help with that is to keep food in certain places. And I guess being in class is kind of how school works. No one wants to lose one lunch, but if we don't start getting the fifth hour on time, we're going back to 25 minute lunch shifts. I guess it isn't that weird to expect students to be in class, especially after 49 minutes of free time. You're all right. That doesn't even answer what I said to you. 